Now it's time for us to talk entertainment. South African-born stand-up comedian and TV host Trevor Noah just became the first black comic to win the Dutch Erasmus Prize, the prestigious European prize named after philosopher and humanist scholar Desiderius Erasmus. Now the premium Erasmanian foundation selected the former host of The Daily Show for his inspired contribution to the theme in praise of Foley, named after Erasmus's most famous book, which is filled with humor, social criticism, and political satire. Now, the prize, which comes with a cash prize of 150,000 euros, approximately $159,000, is given annually to a person or institution that has made an exceptional contribution to the humanities, the social sciences, or the arts in Europe and beyond. Now, the foundation applauded Noah for garnering a young, diverse, and global audience, offering a breath of fresh air to media, especially through peculiar times as Donald Trump's presidency, COVID-19, and the Black Lives Matter movement. Now, although the world was shocked with the news of his exit um, from The Daily Show after his seven-year run, the foundation praised Noah for upholding what they've called the Erasmian spirit. Now, well, fans of the 39-year-old can also expect his new book about forgiveness, acceptance, and the secrets of solidarity. Um, Hollywood Reporter broke the news earlier this month. What can I say? A big congratulations to Trevor Noah, of course, making Africa proud uh, on the global scene. Now let's talk a little further on the international scene. Former Disney star Demi Lovato is tapping from her roots for her directorial debut film. Now the Hulu documentary titled Child Star tackles the topic of the realities of childhood stardom. Now according to the streaming platform, the film will explore how children are propelled to superstardom at a young age and how their rise to fame, fortune and power affects their futures. Now, Demi Lovato herself made her television debut in 2002 on Barney and Friends at the age of 10, later booking her breakout role on the Disney Channel movie Camp Rock along with the Jonas Brothers in 2008. Now, in a statement, the upcoming director had this to say. She says, there is no better film or topic for my directorial debut than this story, which is close to home. Our project sheds light on important messages uh, about growing up in the public eye, learning to protect our boundaries and becoming active advocates in our own destinies. Now, Word in the Street is the anticipated documentary film will chronicle the lives of a number of child stars, their personal struggles and their triumphs. Now, the studio is keeping further details as top secret. For now, fans can take a back seat as the Hulu film is expected sometime in 2024. Now, as a young man myself, or should I say as a Disney fan myself, uh, I did see a couple of these, uh, mu in fact, musicians, actors growing up, and they were all super talented. 